SL to the UG. You might have knew me, but let me introduce you to the new me. What's good, lifers? It's a Sunday in the South. Sitting out here on the porch, soaking up this sunlight, increasing my vitamin D levels, uh, listening to nature. I had to listen to my body this morning, finally. And I got some rest. I got some rest. I came home straight from working, laid it down. I had to. It was a rough night. It was a rough night. I didn't record last night, as you see, because it is daylight. And I just opened the video up. Uh, just reflecting, though. Uh, Friday, we lost uh, Chadwick Boozman. Boozman, however you said. Uh, his battle with colon cancer. And it just makes me uh, think back to those times where you tired or you got other stuff going on in your life and you continue to push through. Uh, a great man. He battled colon cancer for four years, but his body of work never reflected what was going on with him personally. And I have to commend his showmanship. I have to commend the showmanship to know that damn, the show must go on. Uh, you doing what you love to do, so you gonna push through whatever you got going on. And I don't know, man. It kind of made me. It kind of made me say I was gonna get my my stuff together. Man, it seems like you always hear sirens. Could that much really be going on in the world? It's a Sunday. Everybody's supposed to be relaxed and chill. But it just made me think about, like, the things that I got going on. I be tired. Um, I got a three-year-old, so he requires a lot of energy. He's a ball of energy. Go. He on go mode 24-7. Unless he sleep, he on go. And I got to be on guard to make sure he's not getting into anything. Uh, he will steal off and try to knock me out if, if he catch me slipping. So I always got to keep my guard up around, little fella. DJ a monster. Yeah, that was a side note. I was thinking about the kid in there taking a nap now. I guess that's why I'm trying to get in this record session. But it just made me say, like, uh, as soon as I woke up today, uh, I started producing the show for tomorrow. I always release on Monday. Uh, just a little something to start the week. It's some either lighthearted or either some information that I want the life us to think about. Uh, the last couple of ones have been about sex. I might, well, I'm not going to say I might because I already know. I already started producing the episode. It, uh, it'll be a trilogy. So tomorrow's episode will be about uh, just sex. Just want to get people more in tune with their sexuality. Uh, can I say I am in tune with mine? Not as much as I would like to be, but it's it's a, it's a process, and I'm gonna keep working at it. I'm gonna keep you know learning and growing and evolving as a sexual creature that I am. But. Nah, yeah, so if y'all uh, get some free time tomorrow, check out that uh, Slug Life, the podcast, available on all platforms, Apple, Spotify, just about anywhere you could listen to a podcast, I'm there, Slug Life, the podcast, hosted by yours truly. Uh, the greatest debate for tomorrow is, will I have a guest or will I do the show solo? Uh, shout out to my partner in crime. What's good, Steph? Steph and I uh, are self-quarantined right now, so we haven't been able to record. And I could do it virtual like I do with some of my other partners, but I like that camaraderie when we in studio. It's like we, we spawn, we throwing thoughts and ideas back off each other. So I don't know, man. I hope all is well with her and she bounced back and we can get back to work here soon. 
Then I thought about tapping in with one of my partners, you know, doing the virtual thing, you know. I still might. I still might. It's just um, enjoying this peaceful day. Uh, as much as I love getting to it and making money and producing content and I don't know, building, building towards my legacy. I also enjoy the quiet time where I'm able to sit down and reflect on what I've done, what I need to do. So, I'm gonna stop. I'm gonna stop and cut it short here, man. I'm gonna do a little editing work and get this video out. Get this video out, man. I, I always wanna stay true to my word and I do this every day. Every day I do this. Uh, I think today's day 17, maybe? 17, 18? I don't know, I had to check when I upload, but hey, let's keep it going, man. 21 days to develop a habit. 21 days to break a habit. A uh, shout out to my partner in crime, the Honorable Chazare Seward. Uh, he just, he hit me with a challenge, man. He hit me with a challenge. And it made me, uh, with, with the, the recent events that have happened, it really is making me push, push forward um, to stop smoking. I mean, it's a bad habit. I've been smoking since a kid. I've probably been smoking the last 20 years or better. But um, I appreciate my partner in crime for, I don't know, planting that seed in me. Planting that seed in me. And y'all know how it is. I'm Patty Patty. I can't let my brother outdo me, so let's get to it, man. Gang, gang, I'll be back in a few lifers.